Morning guys, so you know how well I plan everything, right? I thought it was maybe an hour and a half away. Uh, she, she doesn't even know yet, so good morning. Two and a half hours away. <laughs> All right guys, so here we go. We're gonna to go to the ape caves. That has nothing to do with the primal beast. Look at that. Okay, so Angie and I were just talking. Do you guys remember like the Croft Super Show and Super Buggy? I know, I'm totally dating myself. I barely remember it, but there you go. That's the same color too. That's pretty freaking badass. Road 83 for one and a half miles. Oh, Lava Canyon. They've got a, a Lava Canyon down this. Oh, they got cougars. <laughs> Which type? The human <laughs> or the animal? which are basically some of the same. Anyway. Okay, so we're finally here. I have created my own parking spot. Look at that. Because um, it's busy here today. It is like hella busy. Um, again, never been here before, so I don't know if like all these people are like being cave dwellers or what. And so we have also brought like warm clothing, although right now dying. It, it's freaking hot. But uh, in in the cave, it's supposed to be what I say, 42 Fahrenheit, which is yeah. five and a half Celsius. Like that, yeah. Yeah, there you know. Oh wow! And here is the entrance. Wow. We just had to clean our shoes to help save the bats because of white noise syndrome. That makes sense now. Now that I think about it, dust. Whoa! We're descending. Wow! After you. <laughs> Gotta watch where I'm going. It sucked. Wow. Cool. We're in the process of descending right after I tripped. I want to leave that in because that was comical. Here we go. We're going. Sorry, that was me. <laughs> oh, we're going down more. Yes. So there's the entrance way up there. And we're turning around and we're going down. Hopefully these stairs I don't trip on because that's a long way down. Oh, I can feel the breeze now too. That's our breath. I don't vape and I don't smoke. <laughs> so this one right here is the, the one that's, um, I think, harder. This one down here is the one that's easier. Okay. I was planning on doing both. Yes, for sure. Okay. I'll let's this one. <laughs> that's why I like her. <laughs> let's do this. I'll get it done. Wow. So we're going down further now. Wow. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. That is outstanding. I wish I had a better camera for dark, because this is amazing. And of course I have to do this. <laughs> I just looked up and happened to notice this. Doesn't that look like Egyptian writing? So, okay guys, basically what this is, is it's a lava tube. So, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years ago, when lava flowed through here, the outside got cold, solidified, and then all the lava inside the tube continued to drain out. So that's why we have this huge cave. We get a little focus going on. We saw some little meatballs and some big meatballs. What do you think? Okay, I'm gonna take a still photo. But once this lantern goes around a corner, it's gonna be awesome. <laughs> We're looking for bats. Wow. And if we hadn't have seen one in one of these little crevices, I wouldn't have believed it. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I don't have a flashlight. I suggest you get one. <laughs> this is just like the Hiawatha. We have all my lights. 
light to my children. Your children should be your light. <laughs> Here, put your hand in there. What is that? Okay, I'm gonna stick my hand in here and then do this. <sighs> Put your head over here. We could do this for like the still frame. What are we doing? I don't know, we're just making faces. Because <laughs> <laughs> you've been in here for so long, you're gonna perish. <sighs> yes! <laughs> Hole, holy hole. <laughs> oh, Troy. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's hard to see, guys, and I know it's not focusing, but here's like ground level, and then we go up, and there's another one of those shelves up there. I would love to be able to get there, get up there, and like scare the shit out of people as they go by in this cave. God, make all sorts of noises, throw things. So we've reached the end. Up here is a little shelf, and down below right here is where uh, mud has basically flowed to the end so that it covers and blocks the rest of the cavern, cave, whatever. Ow, God, that's bright. Ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we just got to doing the lower cave, which is three quarter miles. We're gonna go and do the upper cave. Difficult walking. Enter at your own risk. Oh, shit, I fell. So, oh. Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> oh, you're funny. Look, every, all the straights are exiting up above. Look at the, look at the light, the patterns of light. That's awesome. So in this section here, the uh, the roof is caved in. So uh, we're this is actually behind us. We just passed this. So now we're going, we're going this way. I feel like we're going to have a Goonies adventure. Like Data is going to like come out and say, "Hey guys." <laughs> All right, it's a little hairy, but that's okay, just have it waxed. That's where we have to, we have to get up there. I think we'd fit right through there, can't we? Like a mile and a half of terrain like this. Uh, and just look at that rock. You guys see that? Yeah. That is just waiting to freaking fall down. I, I, no. Fuck. Look at that. And all those rocks that were right there are now right down here. <laughs> this is seriously scary. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again. I don't like it. Said you don't know anything about. I don't know anything about horror movies. I'd scare the fuck out of you if I wanted to. <laughs> okay, so the backstory on this is that the people behind us are talking about like the first one to go during a, a horror movie, and the one guy back there is like, "Oh, I'm the annoying one, so I'll be going last." Holy cow! Oh my god, we to go up there. Yeah, that's awesome. Holy shit. I can't hear anything either. Sorry about the wind. But five years old. Wow. That's awesome. There's a couple holes in here that swallow them though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Are you going to do another frizzy picture? <laughs> You the one down in the cave when the guys down there said, they, hey, there's a Blair Witch down here. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Are you ready? Freaking intense. <laughs> oh, this ain't so bad. So we got foothold there, one up there. Awesome. It's kind of nice to have people here helping. 
They put a knot and put it between two rocks, so it's probably not. Really? Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, really? Wow. Okay. <laughs> so, well, let's we did it. Holy crap. <laughs> you think so? I'm not sure. I don't know if we're supposed to go over or under. Are they going under? I don't know. Are you guys going under or over? Yeah. We're going over. 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 That sounds... There's like 30 of us, so who knows? Oh. <laughs> Ouch. Walking along again, I said, God, those look like cave drawings. Oh. <laughs> People have written stuff on the wall. Oh, saw. Look at that. Saw. Sam. Oh, Sam? Michelle. No, Sam Michael. and Dean? Michael, Sam. Wow. Holy cow. I don't think this, wow. Gazoom tight. <laughs> That is awesome. I hope they have it like roped off from up above so people won't fall in. <laughs> that's crazy. So that's not the end yet. We're not out. But uh. Wow. So we continue into darkness. This is awesome. This has been a most excellent adventure. <sighs> Look, guys, we made it. That was freaking that awesome. Was that was so cool. <sighs> a feeling of freaking accomplishment. Oh, daylight. <laughs> oh, wait, what's up there? Oh, you know. I read that there is more cave up here. Really? Yeah. It just goes for a little while longer, I think, and then it, um. Yeah. Very low oh, ceiling. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so the cave didn't end there at the exit. <sighs> and we kept going. And we kept going. <sighs> and look, we found the cave fault line. Look at that. I'm saying it. Oh my god. Oh, this is the end now. Oh, really? Balls. Yeah, right where everybody is. Uh, somebody sealed the cave with a kiss. Um, 2011. Yeah. Oh, is that glow in the dark? Hold on. It smells in here it's like somebody's been taking. Defecating. <laughs> Who dares to defecate in my cave? Turn the light off. Is that, um. Oh, come on. If you're going to paint neon on the side, at least make it glow in the dark. Come on, people. Just exactly. Exist. I love that. Don't just exist. Live. Don't just exist. And now. Where do these stairs go? They go up. Oh, Jesus, it's hot. Coming out of the cave. Dun -dun. Uh, don't fall backwards, that would suck. And we're out. Excuse me, we're, we're out. We need it. Frizz, frizz girl. <laughs> Just because we're out of the caves doesn't mean that we're back to the vehicle. We have to hike back. But look at that, guys. That is Mount St. Helens back May 18th, 1980. That mountain blew her top. Very majestic, very beautiful. And now she's going to. Oh, I thought you were going to take a picture of me. Let me take a picture. No, I don't want you to take a picture of me. I've got some choice pictures of my armpit here. That was wonderful. Sitting here taking a selfie like this. I'm like, ugh. Sorry. <laughs> That's pretty though. It's dry now because there's been no rain, but this is a creek bed. That was also a lava bed. Look at that. 
Well, this is definitely spooky. No, that's not spider webbing in the trees. Those are caterpillars. Look at that. I'm not sure what's more interesting. That or the huge ass mountain that we were able to get kind of a good view. Oh, wow. Okay. Hi. I guess we're climbing. Yeah, okay. All right, here we go. Oh, that's okay. I can see sliding my butt all the way down. These shoes don't have the same grip as No. Oh my god, there's a lake too. Woo! Ah. It is obscured. Holy cow. Wow. Just as my battery is about ready to die. Really? That's amazing. This has got to be one of the creepiest trees ever. Look at that. Those are all caterpillar nests in the whole tree. Now there's no traffic when we pulled over. And that's just magnificent. Are you ready? You're not filming already, are you? I am. Oh. <laughs> Why you gotta catch me off guard? Uh, because because you're you're cute like that. Okay, I don't think that I need to tell anybody that we're gonna do the t-shirt parade tomorrow because it's it's late and anytime that I ever have like an outing like this, did I say outing? Um, then it's always like a lot to edit because there's so much footage because when you do something special like this you want to make sure you get as much as you can because if you don't film it you ain't got it and sometimes that just sucks because like oh my gosh I should have gotten that and you didn't so long edit we'll do the t-shirt parade tomorrow most likely <laughs> I don't want to promise because I don't want to break a promise we'll start with Matthew Rondell you say hi that barb girl that didn't seem much uh, wait what really that didn't seem like a punishment Really? They ripped hair from my body. I, it hurt. I agree with them. What? You had a grin on your face. <laughs> because I'm sadistic like that. We know this. <laughs> Come on, I was wincing in pain. Look at my face. Look at the still frame. It proves it. That was a punishment. Deal with it. <laughs> um, Stephen Nelson, um, are you getting ready for your girlfriend? Well, I always get ready for her whenever she comes here. That's just what, what people do, right? Because if you don't get ready, then you're not ready. And if you're not ready, pff, you're not ready. And that's so sad to not be ready. Thank you. Okay, Jesse T, I so need to get a t-shirt. Yes, you do. Hey, I tried to get one and they were sold out of my size in the color I wanted. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll make it happen. Hi, Buffy. Hi, Buffy. Hi. On your bed. <laughs> On your bed. <laughs> No, stop talking back to me and get on your bed. She's like a big child. I know. <laughs> Mia, two beady eyes. It's great to see you, or it's great to see Angie and you together. You look so happy. Well, that's good, because we are. <laughs> Jolson, that was a week at, what's, what happened? Oh, and four <laughs> thumbs up on that? Did you thumbs that up too? No. Uh -huh. I did, I swear I didn't. Okay, okay. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> uh, Riot Starter B, well, you and, and Jason Christopher 77 said the same thing, which really worries me. You say, what? No happy ending? It was a back wax. Mill Pond Fright Night, only a man would consider waxing a punishment. Us ladies do it on a regular basis just to look beautiful, although not usually on our backs. Just saying. It's uh, funny. <laughs> it is funny. And I agree with her. <laughs> Uh, Nicole Flynn, hi Angie, I'm so glad you're back. Hi. Uh, Troy, you and Angie are so cute together. You both glow so bright. We Hellions need to have sunglasses. Oh, mm. oh thank you. Uh, double happy hauntings. I'd love to see the happy, not sad. Oh, awesome. Well, thank you. There's a panda in there. Oh, sad. Uh, the happy panda, not the sad panda. Not just awesome. Thank you. Jim Erickson, great answer, Angie. Yes, come visit. You want us to come to Florida? No, not he said for me to come. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> You're a brat. 
Timothy Jones, awesome vlog today. Hi, Buffy, Troy, Angela. That punishment was weak. Balls! It was not. Um, oh, I know. Let Angie do it on you. Oh, oh, that's... Did you see that? She was like, <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow. I have wax. I have wax will travel. <laughs> Is it Canadian wax? Is it different than the wax it's that we Canadian have here? Canadian wax, yeah. Okay. It will it's work stronger. on me? I mean, I am a hoser, apparently. I got some good wax. <laughs> okay. Carrie Ann Olsen, and it's funny that you should say this because getting your back waxed to me is, it, it felt kind of like a tattoo. I mean, not not exactly, but as far as like, you know, pain or whatever. Um, and a, a tat, oh shit. I was going to say a tattoo is not that bad. And it's like, oh, well then the punishment wasn't that bad either, was it? Whatever. Um, but no, I, I, I do want to get another tattoo. I do. You need a tattoo too. Mm -hmm. Wow. Awesome. Joshua Doobie, you guys are one awesome couple. I hope you guys get to grow into skeletons together. Oh, that's the sweetest thing. <laughs> Most people that aren't haunters would be like, that's sadistic, that's wrong, but oh. Yeah, prop me up in a haunt somewhere too. <laughs> Jason McDougal, um, I just got through touching on this kind of, um, what do you think is worse, getting a tattoo or having the back wax? Um, I don't know. Tattoo. I mean, Waxing is... Well, yeah. I mean, a tattoo is like, you know, if you've ever seen an engraver, it's like an engraver on your arm. It's got a lot of vibrations, a lot of pinpricks, like thousands and thousands of pinpricks. But other than that, I mean, if you can, it's not, it's, I don't know. I've heard that it depends on where you get it to. Trip 27, who else was disappointed that Troy didn't scream once during the waxing? Jamie Shea, you are answering yesterday. Nope, spent $5, won 10, and turned that in for a $10 ticket, which I never play, and won the $100. Okay, now that's awesome. That's cool. <laughs> oh my God. Branson Haunted Hills. Okay, to start with, I thought you were getting a tattoo on your butt. <laughs> then when you're watching this, it looks like she was spanking you. Best part of this video, Angie. Aww. You two are oh, you two are soulmates, and your happiness is contagious. Mm -hmm. I love it. And she barked. That was so funny. <laughs> she got that. Oh my gosh. I didn't think anybody caught that. <laughs> <laughs> we had our photo shoot today at the haunt. Holy hell! At the work that we had to do to get everything ready, and it was nine and a half hours of photographers and models and makeup. We are beyond beat. Wow. wow. Yeah. And she's right about the roots. 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 <laughs> I'm so happy you have her to get you straightened out on matters like this. Oh, wow. Wow, those are some big roots. 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 Ha! Ha! Oh, my God. Uh, Jason Matthews, why are you waxing your back? Are you going Metro? Please listen to Brad Paisley's I'm Still a Guy Before It's Too Late. <laughs> Animal Gypsy Heart. Chris, her husband says that you've got bigger, uh, you say, hey, Bose, I mean, I think that you mean, um, oh, well, what is that? Balls, what is yeah. balls? <laughs> Huevos, that's it. Huevos, then him. See, see, it would be a punishment to him. He doesn't do it. I dare any of you guys to say, oh, that's no big deal. Go out and do it yourself. And if you don't have hair on your back, number one, you're lucky. Uh, number two, shave your chest or, or have your chest waxed. Mm -hmm. Those are painful places. Neither one of them. <laughs> yeah, but it's not pleasant. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a 20 minute vlog. Oh, why do you have a long sleeve shirt on? Because I've got the AC on because I get heated it up. It's always cold in here. The AC's on, the fan's always blowing. I'm freezing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's why. <laughs> yep, that's why. And way off topic, uh, when you move, what will happen to Devil Dog? Um, I don't know. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to exhume her, so she will stay where she is, and it'll be that's that's that. Happy haunting! Thank you guys for watching. Like I said, we'll do the t-shirt parade tomorrow. I think most likely we we're will. We're doing it tomorrow. Okay, we're doing it tomorrow. Get it over with. All right. You keep putting it on. I know I do. It's late, but it's late. Happy haunting, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Ow! 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 God damn it! <laughs> God, that really just happened. <laughs> I shinned myself, that sucks. Owie.